I was just about to just log on to Supermarket Simulator today to do a recording, and then I noticed something. Let me move my face cam out of the way. Oops, that's not my face cam. Hold on. Look at this. Look at what this says right here. Upcoming. Moving items without boxes. Door interactions. Detailed settings menu. Cleaning. Self-checkout counters. Oh, that's cool. I never even read that far yet. Detailed economy app to see price changes, customer statistics, inventory, and all prices. Shoplifters. Oh, there is going to be thieves. Security guard, CCTV, anti-theft doors, expiration dates for some items. Putting items on scale to attract more customers. Online orders and delivery around the city. Bigger city to travel and deliver around. Oh, there's going to be deliveries. Random wholesale offers to sell lots of products at lower price for instant income. Veggies and fruits and weighing them to sell. Complete your day cycle to run your store at nights too. Purchase goods from a local market at lower cost by physically going to it. Oh, these, that actually, that's going to be pretty crazy. I almost feel like waiting for it, but right now I feel like maybe I should just continue and take advantage of it being a little bit easier before that happens. Like, make some money so I can get the security guards in and watch what happens. You know what? I want security guards, but I don't want a door that stops them. I want them to be able to run, and I want the security guards to chase them down the street and just knock them out. You know what? I never really just walked around the town. Let's just take a look. Hey, you. Stop. 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 Okay, just push me out of the way with your car. Well, this is a cool area. Hmm... Oh. Woodhouse Spa Center. Okay, I, I could see how they could add more stuff around here. I'm curious to see where this game goes in the future. Because I feel like it really... I don't know if it's been... I don't know when the last time it's been updated was. Oh, it just said it was going to add door interactions. I was thinking you're trying to interact with the door. Okay, so... Let's see what we have in stock. We got the powdered sugar. That's already filled up. Um, we got some extra oils. Uh, so spaghetti goes by really fast. I do need some oil. There is a lot of salt. That's technically a ton of salt. Is there anything we don't have on this list? We can get some more cereal. Um, some water bottles. I want some coffee and tea. Um... Olive oil, I feel like salt's fine. Pasta spaghetti, that's $300. I do not have enough of that, okay. Let's get rid of the pasta spaghetti. Purchase all of that, that way we'll have some extra stuff in here too. Hey, don't tip over, you can stay styled. I don't, why did the smallest box on the bottom? Who, who's stacking this? They're like, yeah, let's put the small box on the bottom, put everything else on top of it. I wonder what item that is they're trying to crush. probably like a vegan and they're like we're gonna ruin this meat well you're just making it so we have to order more so i wonder how that worked out in your mind So they stacked everything on the peanut butter. You know what? I can't be mad about that. Peanut butter solid. Peanut butter solid. Okay. I think we are good for the day. I mean, we don't have any money. We're good for the day. We're open. We need money. Oh, another day at the supermarket. We might need more milk and eggs. The cheese looks fine. I always look like there's one side that's missing a water bottle. I don't know. I am really proud about how we have the shelves set up so far. Like, I feel like that's pretty pretty. It's pretty pretty, you know what I mean? Use the same word twice. Hope it makes sense. Oh, you make you're buying a lot of pasta. All right. Hold on. Seven dollars. Okay, get on out of here. What is that guy getting? Oh, he's getting a lot of rice. Oh, lots of flour and rice. 
and this. Two kinds of flour? Two kinds of flour, okay. Experimenting. Okay, wait, hold on. Before I just type that in, I need to remember that there is a decimal in place. Oh, what about you? Okay. You just want some regular stuff? That's fine, that's fine. Everyone's paying with card today. Yeah, what's weird is the day before I got this game, I actually had a dream about it before I got it. And so I was just like, you know what? Maybe I do need to get this game. Although it was more of a nightmare. I was waiting for vampires to come in, so... <laughs> I was just like sitting here waiting for a vampire. <sighs> mm, my eyes feel really dry today. Maybe I need to drink some water. I don't even... Well, my water bottle's not even over here by me. Oh yeah, it is by me. Don't come over here yet. I'm eating a french fry. Hold on, huh? Hold on. You know what? You can wait. I'm enjoying my french fry, sir. I wanted some cocoa puffs, some bread, and some powdered sugar. Honestly, not a bad mix, but you should buy something healthy, too. Bottled water was too expensive for you? Look how you're dressed, and you're saying bottled water is too expensive for you. You have the money. Don't even try acting like you don't. Maybe you only had $20. Well, you guys are both- Do you guys realize you guys are twins? Man, a little slow in the cash register. What'd you say about the cheese? You know what? I don't even care what she said about the cheese. Shop somewhere else. Oh, you bought this much stuff. How much did you pay with? You paid with a 50 and you want $17 back in change? You could have you just bought it. You know that. Whatever it is you were complaining about. I debated on if I wanted to give that to her or not. I'm just like, she complained. Maybe this will just make her real happy now. She'd just be like, and you don't even know how to count. That's probably what happened. Oops. Oh, five. Boom. Dollar fifty one. All right. I think I'm gonna have to get a soda here in a second. I really am just feeling extra tired this morning. Oh wait, we need to stock some peanut butter. All right, sorry for the wait. Oh, oh, I gotta turn on the lights. I was like, it was getting dark in here. Oh, I need to put lights right here in the middle. I can't even see you. Can't see anybody. There's too much glare. There's too much glare on my table. Oh my goodness. Okay. Wow, these people are just taking all my resources. Look at all these big orders. I'm gonna have to have entire shelves of stuff pretty soon. Oops, that's not what I wanted to pick up. Uh, what do we need? What do we need? What do we need over here? We need pasta. We need bread. Oh, we need cheese and milk. Oh my goodness, you guys really just took everything. Yeah, I, I'm. Yeah, you guys took everything. She took two milks. She's like, you're running out. I'm making sure I get all of it. Oh, paid card. Okay, here you go, ma'am. You can go ahead and step out my sword. Okay, it looks like my sword's closed for the. Oh. Oh really? Oh. Oh really? Okay, you guys better not complain that there's nothing in the store. Let them just take everything. Oh, he made a lot of money today, actually. I mean, they may have bought everything in my store, but, you know, I'm going to be able to restock tenfold. Oh. Yeah, I couldn't find stuff. Not my fault. 
Oh, insufficient change. I can't just take the eighty dollars. <laughs> yeah, they would have. It would have been a problem if that was the case. All right, bye. Okay, we are closed for the day. Stay gone. We are closed. All right, look at this. It was all pretty before. Now it's all gone. Okay, let's see how much money we made. My goodness, we made a lot. 392 profit. That is not bad. And we spent like 200 and was down to zero and made it all the way back up to 600 though. Okay, bottled water's up. That's up. Now that we have $693... I need to refill my stock and pay my... I'm going to pay the loan real quick. Hold on. We'll pay that every time. There we go. That's just something I'm going to say is a must that I have to pay. Um, The market. Let's see here. We're going to need a lot of materials.
my goodness, it's gonna look so nice, actually. Okay, I think we are good to go for the day. Let's just look at the market real quick and see what other stuff there is. Um, let's look at the bills real quick. Bank, payments. Okay, no, nothing here. Management, bills, two days. Bill. Um, you know what? We could just pay this stuff off. Let's just pay this stuff off. Perfect. Licenses. $500 growth, section 3 is 750 hiring, requires store level 10 to hire my first cashier, storage is $800, customization, entrance position, change the position of the entrance, store name, change the name of the store name, um, change entrance, change the appearance of the entrance, oh, wait, entrance position, change, the entrance. oh, the appearance and the position name, okay. Let's go back, market, furnitures, paints. I wonder what I can end up painting. Floor? I can change the floor in here? Oh, I don't have enough money for any of these. Is there a cheap one? Nope, what one would I even want? What does this floor look like? It looks like that. Okay, that is pretty dirty. I would like to have... This... I don't know, I feel like carpet's kind of weird for a store, isn't it? This white tile looks nice. Maybe this tan tile, something like that. Um, I want this corner one right here. Shelf corner, yes, 210 points. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I want another double fridge. What am I having one of these? Another cashier place, okay. I just wanted to analyze everything. Let's open up the shop for the day. We are more than ready to start making some deals. We got a lot of product. Got some creamy coconut Dr. Pepper. Isn't that weird? Not sponsored. That could be. They wanted to. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I just put a bunch of product up, sir. And you already went ahead and bought that much? Like, I mean, come on. How's this gonna last if I have customers like you come in here? Thank you, though. I will take your $52 donation. Oh, they're gonna cry about prices. You came in here, we had all this product, and you just bought salt? Okay. You said something about the price of pasta? Oh. Probably just needs to get changed by 10 cents. I should probably keep an eye, eye on these things. Oh yeah, my bread could be more expensive. There, okay. That's one of the reasons I probably get a lot of cells, though, is because it's so cheap that they're just like, yeah, let's buy a whole bunch of it. I wonder if there was ever a way to cheese the game to, like, set the price to, like, 800000 The salt's too expensive for you. Let me look. How do you even know these prices changed last night? Last night. I think the more expensive something is, the more I can get away with upping the price. So, like, if it's automatically $10, I could probably do, like, 15 But if it's something that's usually a dollar and I put, like, 5 it's going to be a lot more significant. This guy it literally only came for the milk. Well, he got his milk. But something a lot of people are grabbing in my store right now. Let's check these prices. Seven? Oh, yeah, that could be a bit more. Okay. I just want to be a little more efficient on my money. I should have checked that way before we started. 
now that we have it, I think we are good. Unless the prices change during the day and somehow they know the prices have changed. Like if the stock market crashes like in 10 seconds, they're all coming here and be like, this is too expensive. I don't, I don't know that. What are those three over there doing? They're doing something shady over there. I think they're trying to shoplift. Or it's going to be one of those public videos. You come into my store with a hundred dollar bill again, you are going to be banned from this store, absolutely blacklisted from every store in town. Yeah, look down at the monitor like that. Honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if this guy came into the store and then someone else came into the store holding a phone against his face saying, This guy came to meet a 12 year old girl. That's the type of guy he looks like. <laughs> this guy looks like his name would be Mr. Peanut Butter. Okay. Have a good day, Mr. Peanut Butter. They're trying to take it off the shelf as I'm holding it. R leave me alone. I tried to place it. They're too fast. Hold on. Sorry, customers. These guys are fighting me over here. Okay, here we go. Speed on. One twenty-two cents. Okay. Boom. Let's go next customer. Cash. Okay. Boom. You're done. Okay. Next customer. Cash. Seven dollars. Okay. Boom. 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 Next customer. Yep. 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 Want to pay with the card? Okay. That'll be thirty-seven. Oh my goodness! I thought I clicked thirty, but I guess not. Thirty-nine. Boom. Next customer. They're all saying a whole bunch of nonsense. I don't even care about this guy. Came back into my store. Okay. He brought card this time instead of a hundred-dollar bill. Thank you, sir. I don't know what those three customers are doing, but they have stuff in their bags. And they're, they're basically thieves if I have anything to say about it. Oh my goodness. I'm just trying to fix that. Sorry, sir. Customers in the back are causing a lot of problems. What are you guys even? What are you guys even trying to get right here? Huh? Oh, you wanted to pay the card? Okay, sorry, sir. A lot of stress today. We've had the same three customers lottering in here. Lottering, lottering. Running today. I can't even handle that. That's nonsense. Um, I feel like we're pretty much good. I just need rice and peanut butter. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just rice and peanut butter. That's all I, I just need those two items and we're good. Let's pay off our bills too. Products. Let's see here. Peanut butter. Where the heck is the rice? Little green box. Oh, blue box. Blue box, right? Yeah. Right here, let's purchase that. That's all we need for today. Let's go down here to the bank. Pay that off for today. We have $500 now. Furnitures, let's see. 
a mini fridge. I wonder if that is for like sodas. Like maybe only sodas can get put in the mini fridge. The double fridge unit is so much better. Okay, that was a lot of money. I will admit that was a lot of money. However, we're going to do some cool stuff in here in a second. Yes, yeah, so I want to number sweet. Okay, so we've got the wall there. Boom. Well, get you lined up. Perfect. Actually, I don't know how that works. We're still a small little store, so don't want to go too crazy on some of the stuff I can do. Uh, only if I can line those up better like that. Why is it gotta be like that? Otherwise, that looks a little awkward like that. Things like just. I know. Oh, well, let's make one of these work. Yeah, this is one of these. What makes you think? 90%. If that one right there was another corner, I'd line it up. It's fine. I thought this happened like that. This is actually kind of nice. I mean, I, can't, I like being able to see all my products where it's at. Once I have somebody working cashier, I can just kind of stand out where they do stuff. And if I'm just thinking, I can trust myself. So that is what I like to do once I get to that one. Okay. So for now, let's see. Is that going to be shelves? I think so. It's not utilizing this yet. We can just cram this right here. Go ahead and just stuff. Okay. I think that was a good investment because now I have more refrigerator space and more shelf space. The next thing I should buy is the next, what's it called, license, like the next food handler's license type thing for being able to sell like sodas and such. And then I want to buy the next section to make this place bigger and then maybe start getting another row and a cashier going. All right, let's do, let's run one more day. Let's run one more day. Let's start this up. I don't have any extra stuff for restocking. That is fine. Hmm. I could also adjust this. Put myself right here. No, it's fine. Oh, sorry, ma'am. We're just doing some changes around the store, you know. Everyone buys groceries here, and then I upgrade the store with the groceries money. It's interesting because through them buying these products, I'm able to buy more. So they're actually just paying for me to buy more of these for them. You're resting. Well, I mean, somebody's gonna be like, well, that's obvious, that's always been the case, and it's just like, well, it's just interesting to think about that in the actual detail. Because I feel like when you go into the grocery store and buy stuff, you don't really think that way. And to, like, pay the, the workers. Sliced bread is too expensive for you over there? Okay. Sorry, ma'am. I was listening to a customer in the back complain. Um, I forgot to adjust the change this time, but next time I'll remember. It's just like, once I get everything stocked up, the first thing I should do is go and check all the prices. But I forget to sometimes. Oh, it's really not that expensive. I think a five cents change would fix it. Ooh, it looks like I'm gonna have to buy more of that stuff. Really? Wait. Oh! Hold on. Oh, that door got me caught. You know what? You guys can just wait. I don't care. Customers can wait while I'm doing something important. Next. Next. Oh my goodness, you're buying one water bottle and you're using a card. Oh, you bought the rest of that? Okay. Dang. Okay, just buy my product up. I'm gonna have to buy some more of that. I didn't realize that was gonna go so fast today. I 
I had more than enough. Okay, let's go over to the computer. <clears throat> Market products. Let's see. We want some more of this. And it looks like pasta's getting kind of low. But you know what? Let's just buy this for now. This is really all I need to get up in here. At least it's fast delivery. Alright, I'm coming. Hope you didn't have, feel like you have to wait that long just for one thing of peanut butter. And you gave me a $50 bill? I'm not even worried about making you wait. I'm not even worried about making you wait. Oh yeah, your card. There we go. You want seven dollars back? Goodness. Oh, I just took ten cents from you, sorry. I clicked a little bit early. You could have just waited. I would have fixed that for you. What is causing them to bug out right there? I'm pretty sure those people are just stealing product from me. They're waiting until the day's over, and then boom. They don't have to pay for what's in their bags. But I remember. Not the right size. Was it the pasta? It was the pasta. Okay, somebody said something in the background. I don't know what he said. He probably was saying the line is full. Out of flour? Okay. Okay, I understand that I'm out of flour. These people are buying it right here because they were holding on to it. Hold on, I gotta turn on this light. I don't like where I set this table. <laughs> oh my goodness, you're buying so much stuff. Hold on. Too much, too much. $83. We almost broke 100 right there. Get on out of here. Next guy. Paying with card. Okay, boom, you're done. I understand that I'm out of flour. Thank you for telling me yet again, sir. Okay. What? Seven... F oh my goodness, what am I even typing in? I understand I'm out of flour. Who else wants to tell me? You want to tell me I'm out of flour? Huh? Make my day. Yeah, that's what I thought. Don't talk about the flour to me. And peanut butter. You want $81 and change. That's not happening. Oh, you guys are just shotgun blasting through here. I don't I can't even buy more product. Okay, it's already nine. You guys put me through the work today. What day is it? So tell me what day it is. It's just like a Friday or something. Uh, crazy day. Yep, let me guess. You're just going to add to the people telling me that I need to add more flour, don't, aren't you? I already know it. You're going to tell me about all the flour I need to do. Milk? I'm out of milk? Well, thank goodness you're the last customer for the day. Goodness. Uh, how much money did we make? We made $200 in profit. We had $900 in sales, though. Okay. That's not bad. $900 in sales. I literally got, like, a bunch of new shelves and stuff. That, oh, I thought someone was already walking in here. Now, I'm going to pretty up everything in here. But that's all the time I have for today. We have done quite a bit. This game is so good. I absolutely love this game. And I can't wait to further this game to the, like, extreme points of, like, having this whole side just be a huge store. 
Oh, and yeah, and I can change the- it says I can move the door at some point and change the appearance. I can put the door right in the middle. Oh! That actually might be a spot for where the door's supposed to be in the end. That would be cool. I can, like, put stuff on both sides. I can't wait till I get the storage over there and have workers for me, like stalkers and, um, cash register, register people. I, I, I don't know what you want to call them. What is it? Hiring. Cashiers. Restalkers. Okay. I need to be level 15 for a restalker. I guess I'm going to be the restalker. So I can get a cashier pretty soon once I level up one more time, which is probably going to be one more day. Then... Um, I'll just be the restocker until I can get this guy, and once I get these two, I can kind of just let them do the work, unless I want to get another cashier thing going, or re help him restock, so. Yeah, it looks like I'm going to have to buy a lot of product here in the coming day. But anyways, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and we will continue tomorrow. Thank you very much for watching.